Hello and welcome back to another Gigavac Tech Talk. I'm your host, Brian, and today we are talking about how to program the MXSL. That's this contactor right there. Also known as the automatic low voltage disconnect, this is the ultimate battery saver contactor. When used correctly, this device will help prevent dead batteries, increasing vehicle uptime, saving time and money. So let's dive in. To get started, I have the programming harness plugged into my laptop. The other end, follow it down here, is connected right to the contactor. A power supply is also connected with those red and black wires shown here. Notice the power supply is turned off. That is important. So the first step is to open the programming software on your computer. You can download this software right from our website. I'll show you how to find it. If you go to gigavac.com, mouse over catalog, contactors and fuses, the MX contactors and click that. Then if you scroll down on the page, you'll see configuration software for MXSL. That's it. Now I already have this installed on my computer, so let me launch it. Let's close this window. Launch the code right here with this icon and it opens up this pop-up window. So the first step is you must select which COM port you're connected to. In my case, I believe that is COM port number seven. So I'm gonna select that. Now, if I click for search MXSL, it's gonna to try to connect to it and you'll see the green status bar go across the page. That's how much time you have to turn the power on. If you don't turn the power on, your session's gonna time out and you'll get a little pop-up just like this. So let's close that pop-up. Now let's do it again. But before I click search this time, I'm going to Scroll widen out here, wide view. I'm going to try to do this all in one frame. So I'm going to click search and then I'm going to turn on the power supply. And as soon as I do, you'll see that immediately the configurator connects. So now we can click read to get the values out. So these are the values that this contactor is currently programmed to. It has a 24 volt alarm voltage. It has an 18 volt shutoff voltage and a 10 second delay. Now, to show you just how easy this is to program, let's change a few of these. Let's change this 18 to say, I don't know, 20 volts. And we'll change the delay time to, how about five seconds? Now, once you've got all the values plugged in that you want to program it to, you just click this button that says write. And you'll notice all of the values, the font color changes to red. That means your write is successful. You can click on read to read the values back out and the font color turns to blue. This is now what it's programmed to. There's our 20, there's our five and our 24. So that's it. The MXSL is now fully programmed and ready for installation. I'll make another video showing how it works. Thank you for watching.